friends. Welcome back to my channel. Do you notice anything different? If you're new here, you probably don't. I dyed my hair. But I'm Michi Wee and I'm on a weight loss journey. And today my hands are purple. I used Dollar Tree gloves and it went right through. So dealing with this for a couple days. But I gotta say, I absolutely love how the hair came out. And I think today's theme is gonna be finally. Finally, I updated my hair to a vibrant color that I've been wanting to do for a while. Finally, I'm gonna make the poke bowl that I said I was gonna do like three days ago. And finally, I'm going to clean the house after taking a week off. Also, finally, my plateau is definitely over with and I am starting to steadily drop pounds. I think I'm one week away from losing 10 pounds since the beginning of this YouTube vlogging journey. And in total, that will be 50 pounds down from where I started at 210, about a little over a year ago. It was a very long plateau where I even gained like extra five pounds. So I think I needed YouTube to kind of kick me back into gear and it is definitely doing that. Fear of looking like a jackass can be a real motivator sometimes. With all of that said, it's gonna be a pretty busy day and I need to start cooking. But first, I wanna tell you what I'm gonna throw in this poke bowl. There's gonna be sweet potatoes, there's gonna be peas, there's gonna be carrots, there's gonna be tuna. I think the sauces are gonna be the important part. In my head, I know what I wanna do with the tuna, but I don't know what I wanna do for the rest of it. And like always, I'm gonna mutilate recipes I found online and try and make my own thing. It never turns out good. I don't know why I continue to think I can do it. But in my head, these are the ingredients I want. So we're gonna try again. Sometimes it turns out all right. Let's see if it works for me today.
capturing the color here, it just isn't doing it in the house. Yeah, yeah it must be our lights. I swear my hair isn't all blue, it's purple and blue. <laughs> this, none of the colors are showing up on camera. That's so weird. This is, this is the most accurate that, <laughs> that I can get it to look in, on camera. I guess now I know for next time. I love it in real life, but half of my life is being recorded. So I'm going to definitely think about that the next time I dye my hair and figure out what colors show accurately on camera. I have finished all my chores and ran all my errands. And it's five o'clock. So today is pretty much done, but I have 300 calories left and I need to eat something. And I'm low on protein. Shrimp tacos are the plan. I'm using up the last of my shrimp. I haven't weighed it yet. I know a tortilla shell is gonna be 70 calories and a teaspoon of sour cream and guacamole is gonna be minuscule. So I know I'm gonna be in there. The main goal is for the protein. Normally I would show you guys my dinner and that would be the outro, but I was watching YouTube while I was folding clothes and there were like three ads in a row for Air Up. My channel is not a review channel, but because being hydrated is very important to weight loss goals, I need to warn you guys about Air Up. Or maybe not warn, just let you guys know what I'm seeing. So this is not a criticism to other creators who have made Air Up sponsorship commercials. The only time I think I'm going to criticize a creator for their sponsorships is if they are a research channel recommending BetterHelp. Only because BetterHelp fucked up so bad, it's widely known and they are research channels and they should know better. But a commentary channel trying Air Up and saying, hey, I like this, I'm not coming after them. I just want my viewers to know that Arup scored a 1.8 out of 5 at thingstesting.com and the overall consensus is it's not worth it. Specifically, the drinking mechanism itself is not good. This review specifically cracked me up. In a world that tells us we must drink water, you're likely to dehydrate while sucking on the straw. Now, I know I use flavoring for my water, but in a world going crazy for Stanley Cups, I think jumping on the latest trend to get your water in is not gonna change anything about your water. So I will promise to make sure to drink plain old water more if you guys promise not to waste your money and potentially fall for snake oil promises. There are literally so many reviews saying you have been warned. So you've been warned. I am never gonna get a sponsorship on this channel. That's okay. If you can't drink out of the straw, what is the freaking point though? Drinking water should not be a struggle. And with one point being said, let's move on to the next. I may not have to consider my hair color as much as I thought. So I'm going to attempt to split screen or do something here editing wise with the coloration. And if I'm able to do that, you'll see it now. But that's what it should look like in real life. And that's it. That's the last point. So I will show you my dinner, give you the last calorie count, and say goodnight, and I'll see you tomorrow.